Hello and welcome back to Banished, where we have just been hit by a tornado. Uh, we're going to go ahead and hit play. And uh, for some reason, I have turned off my thing again. Let's go there. We have no laborers, builders, we need farmers. We're going to take some people out of the mine. And some stone cutters out, I guess. That's going to give us some laborers. And we're going to start um, rebuilding. Um, first thing, I guess, will be to um, rebuild this. Um, get our fish back going. We lost 50 people in this tornado. Uh, the tornado started right here near the school. I went back and looked. Um, got the teacher, it got students, it um, took some children, uh, took some stone cutters here, you can see where it ended. Um, a lot of devastation here. <clears throat> Structure is being replaced, okay. We'll, uh, we'll do this one as well. Well, we'll start here, rebuild that one. Uh, the reserve of food is low, 489. Uh, they are planting food. What, we lose a brewer, we lost a brewer. Hmm. Let's not work the brewer right now. It's not a good time to get back into jolly drinking. Of course, it may be. People turn to drink, I guess. We may lose family. That's how they deal with it. Uh, we've got ten laborers. We lost a fisherman. That's okay, because we're going to rebuild that. We're going to go ahead and speed up time. We are waiting for uh, two more seeds. We'll get this rebuilt, rebuilt this home. Okay, they've got that one taken apart. Where do we stand? Uh, 355, 252, yeah, it looks like we're doing okay. 40 coal. Are they still digging coal or iron up here? You all are digging iron. Let's switch over to coal for a moment. switch over to coal. 80% of that is remaining. Our fish is going in. We now have 1,200, 1,300 food going up. Okay, here comes our fish. We're going to get ready to start on this one, rebuild that one. Yeah, it tore down all these trees right here. There was a forest right here. Oh, our beans are going in. Good, good, good. They're quick, too. They, they come up quick. We don't have a um, brewer at the moment. Okay, our fish is back. We need fishermen. Don't need two of those. They're building this house back. This one's going. Oh, we've got a boat in. What have you got for us? Do you have any seeds? No, you've got wool, coats, logs. We don't need, we don't need, we don't need, we don't need. No, dismissed. Yeah, they killed 50 people, so... <clears throat> we don't need all of these. This is just kind of in storage. People already have the, if everybody broke a tool at the same time, that then you would need that. But we've got a lot of logs, a lot of stone. How are our, we built two, oh, look at our cemetery. Oh my gosh, it's full. We're gonna need another cemetery as well. Yeah, these two are filling up kind of nicely. Maybe we'll put the cemetery right here. Mm, behind the, yeah, behind the church, maybe, beside the church. 
Yeah, let's do that. Let's build a cemetery beside the church. People need to go and see their loved ones. Be with them. 14 by 7, we'll do that. Yeah, need a bigger cemetery. Okay, that house is going up. Let's start on this one. Rebuild that one. Oh, I forgot that one. Yeah, let's rebuild that one. That house is built. Someone's moved into it. 17 to 23 year old. Yeah. Okay, we will rebuild. That one's being rebuilt. This one, rebuild it. Eight of eight. Yeah, I guess the uh, the stone quarry would have been the uh, best place to run to in a hurricane or a tornado, but um, it hit the, the, I guess the mine would have been the best. Everybody run to the mine. Everybody run to the mine. That would have been a good place to go. Um, yeah, full, full graves, full cemetery, full cemetery. Oh, they dug somebody up. Um... We had just put this fish down, didn't we? We had just placed that fish down. Got these houses being rebuilt. <clears throat> yeah, the uh, the tornado of 32. Uh, year 32. Okay. Killed 50 people. Started right here. Started right near the church. It didn't take the barn, but it took the church, uh, or it took these houses, the teacher. Hmm. Rough times. Rough times for the citizens of Putner. A child named Aldine was born. Aldine, I bet you're over here somewhere in one of these new homes. Aldine, there you go. A little girl. A little girl named Aldine. Aldine. Um, eight students. Three students. Anybody living in here? No. So everybody has a home. Eighty-one to seventy-one year old. Let's see who moves into this one, and uh, 14-year-old boy and a 26-year-old female. Hmm. 1,224. We just had our crops come in. We're bringing in some firewood. Is that boy a student? Yeah, he's a student. Okay. Of course, they can, oh, he just turned 15. We'll rebuild this one and this one. <clears throat> and that should be it. Um, we've rebuilt everything. Let's get our alcohol going again. <clears throat> we need a brewer. We need a farmer as well. Um, brewer, brewer. There we go. Everything good here? Yeah, everything, everything's, everything's back, back to normal. Well, we took in the nomads just in time for tornado to hit the town. Um, of course they wouldn't have survived out in the, well, unless it hit them. They wouldn't have had the support. You need the support. You need the support of a family, town. You can't go out and do it on your own. <clears throat> okay, 136, 
180 180 Okay, this is filling up with the logs Let's uh, tone the logs down just a bit 1,000 logs and turn the firewood up Four thousand firewood, because we can sell firewood. And actually, if we get a boat, we may buy some food. Uh, here comes a boat now. Let's see what you got, buddy? Pepper seeds and wheat seeds. We don't need. We don't need them. Dismissed. Don't need pepper. We got peppers, right? <laughs> We need squash and oh, there's squash. Uh, we need squash. Yeah, peppers. Okay, dismiss. Um, let's bring up some more firewood. Uh, we want uh, venison. We don't need a thousand venison either. Let's go five hundred venison. 500 fish, 500 venison, 150 sheep, some cherries, some berries, ale, iron tools, hide coats, and beef. And that is about it. So we'll bump up the firewood to 3,000. Put that in the bank there. We want to purchase a hundred coal if it comes. We want to purchase a hundred stone if it comes. Oh, that's iron. And we'll purchase a hundred stone. That way these guys don't always have to work in the mines. And um, Oh, what are you out of? L, L, yeah, L. Oh, did we get our brewer back? No, let's, let's, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We need a brewer. Oh, we got one, okay. Okay, it's winter. We are 4,000. How does the, we're 80, 80% 80 full. We got apples, we've got, um, Hole 46, hide coats, leather, pears, yada yada yada, pecans, wool, steel tools. Somebody died of old age, that's good. Um, how many people we have in church? No, we don't need this big church now. Here's our cemetery was built. We've got 25, oh, no, 15. We'll keep two builders just in case. How are we doing with our firewood? Yeah, we want to bring more firewood into here. Uh, and more logs. Let's try some logs in here just in case. Uh, Somebody wants to buy logs because we can always produce logs. It's just firewood is more expensive, uh, pays better. I think logs are three or two or something like that. We could rebuild these homes into stone housing. They would use less firewood. We're going to use up our stone though. Um, Put a whale over here somewhere. Put a whale by the by the barn just in case. We'll build a whale. Come to the whale. Let's 
Let's watch him build the whale. Oh, got lots of coal, lots of iron. Beef up the builders here. Now, if anything happens, they don't have to run to the uh, river to get water. Sometimes, if it's far off, they uh, they won't even attempt it. So we need a well. They create a human chain and drag water. There you go, work on it. We got three. Oh, they had to go home and get a new tool. They broke their tool. They should be smart, they should be educated. They're healthy, but not 100% healthy. Get it going, get it going, get it going. Look at all four of them working on it. Heck yeah. There we go. We have this well now, in case of a fire. They can run and get water from the whale. Uh, again, that's why I kind of like building near the um, ocean. Oh, nomads again. Oh, should we do it? We've had nothing but uh, hard times. Let's pause the game. Um, how many do we have? Still need cabbage and potatoes. <laughs> Nomads. Uh, 25 nomads requesting citizenship. I say we do it. Um, yeah, yeah, we, we, we need to do it because we've got miners, stone cutters. We need the people. Let's do it. Let's see, how many people do we have now? 226. Not sure how many we started with, but we lost 50 in the in the tornado. Okay, let's uh, play again. Now they can move into the boarding house. They're going to all go and get tools, coats, uh, things they need. Let's see, we've got eight not living in a home. How many is down here? Wow. I'm not sure if all of them can live there. Okay, let's build some homes. On the river bank. Tornado would never hit here twice, right? three homes. Uh, let's go back to mining. Go back to stone cutting. Uh, vending. I think we are good. Miners, farmers. We're full and we have ten extra people. Awesome. You're homeless. We got that Getting ready to get that taken care of. Maybe. Oh, we got another boat. Uh, what have you got for us? Bean seeds, corn seeds. Oh my gosh. Um, coal. We could buy coal. 200 coal. That's going to be $1,200. Uh, we'll use. Yeah, they do buy logs, but they're only two apiece, so we'll put a hundred there. That's two hundred. Don't want to give them any food for a moment. We'll give them ten coats. We'll give them twenty tools. An additional six hundred and ninety. So, uh, what do we need? Two um, hundred? That's too much. 180. Uh, overpaying by 30. 70. Uh, 74. Overpaying by 6. Uh, 
go. Trade. So we got the coal. There's some herbs. Chicken pumpkins. Uh, they have stone. It's seven. Squash seeds. We could use the stone as well. Trade logs for stones. We're digging stones right now. Corn. Walnuts. Hmm. We just bought a hundred stone from them because I told it to buy a hundred stone each time. I don't know if we want to buy some more. We've got a hundred logs now. So let's buy 50. That's 300. We can give them all logs. And we need 150. 20. How much is that? I'm overpaying by 10. So we'll give them 95 logs. And trade for that stone. 50 stone. Mushrooms. Wheat. We could buy wheat and make ale. Let's get uh, 90. Let's do 100. Let's do 200. And give them that. That gives us some wheat. <clears throat> make that trade. Ooh, 11,000 food. How much do we have? 3,000. Yeah, we can replenish from from Mianime. Mianime. Pears, herbs, beef, chicken, pumpkins. 2,000 pumpkins. Let's buy 200 of those. And 100 logs. I <laughs> forgot to hit make the trade. Uh, peppers. We can use some of this firewood as well. So we can do 400. 400 peppers and make it what, 100 firewood. Make that trade. 3,000. There we go. Probably going to need. Oh, and he just left. So, probably gonna need another house now. They have a child, yeah, 34 year old moving in, 37 and a 21 year old moving in. Build another house. I don't think I have that boarding house all the way up. Yeah, it is, it's all the way up to the road, okay. Uh, you reached your limit. Let's go 55. Let's make some more. Make some more beer. That's where we bought a lot of wheat. I'm not quite certain if fire breaks out in stone hall in stone houses, but uh, I know they do in the the wooden houses. Uh, we've got 13 people. We can build another house, maybe. Build another house over here. Oh, those three look the same. That was cool. <clears throat> Behind them, we'll build another farm, I guess. Another field. We could split our cows, start making more cattle. Uh, that would make sense in case a tornado comes and takes out your cattle. You want to have them spread out. So, 
let's make a hmm. how big should a cattle field be? How big should a cattle field be? Fifteen by sixteen. Fifteen by sixteen. Okay, we're going to build a cattle farm down here, pasture. Uh, we want, uh, what do we want up here? Did I build an orchard? I built an orchard. Oh my goodness. Um, apples. I clicked on orchard and not... Field, but that's okay. It'll take a month to get it there. I guess it's good to separate your orchards as well. This would be a really bad place to <laughs> have a tornado come through here. Oh my god. Um, okay, it's early spring. They're going to start planting again. People are dying of old age, which is good. Not dying from starvation, tornadoes, or the mumps. Yellow fever. That's why I was nervous about bringing people in because you're 19 and 19, so that's pretty good. It's pretty good, pretty good. Uh, the reserve of food is low. Oh my gosh. Y'all quit eating. I can't really separate the cows because then we won't. Uh, That's a big old field. Twelve of twelve. Reserve of food. Yes, yes, yes. I don't think we want to split this just yet because we're getting food from here. Um, it's built, so... We could do it. Well, we're getting sheep, chickens... Oh, man, what a bad time. Well, we're going to get this food in. Let's separate it. Yeah, I know. Reserve of food is low. Okay, we're going to go with cattle. And, yeah, I guess it is the same size. And we're going to split the herd. Now we need a herdsman. Now these cattle will walk through the tunnel. That is awesome. Half of the cattle will walk through the tunnel. Here they come. They're going to walk through the market as well. Yeah, right through the market. <laughs> How funny. And they are going to end up over here in the field. So we took half of them. We took six. Now we've got a split field of cattle. We can do the same with sheep, chickens, anything. Uh, trading post, what have you got for me? Uh, Zakenzil, Zakenzil, Zakenzil. Well, we can definitely start buying food because we need food. Uh, let's buy everything that is. Let's buy a hundred. A hundred. Onions. A hundred. Cabbage. Let's give them another taste of cabbage. 200 cabbage. Let's give them some potatoes because we need potatoes. 200 potatoes. And then we have cherries. So how much do we need? We need $700. This one's, he's kind of a cheapskate. He's only letting us pay 300 for that. Uh, logs are a dollar a piece. So hide coats are 15. He needs hide coats. Let's give him that. Additional 500. So let's give him our logs. Now we need 450. Let's give him 
all 20 hand tools and hopefully we can do 29 three goes into 29 a hundred times is it uh, we're overpaying by 10 so we could take that away one of them uh, 19 all overpaying by two take one uh, take two of these away it's going to buy us a lot of food. Hopefully our food stores will go up as soon as the vendors and the traders. We've got, uh, yeah, we've got six. They'll move it along pretty quickly. Um, I think that is about it because it's almost, it's late spring. They're going to be harvesting soon. We could do some more. To 200 cabbage again. Uh, let's do 300 cabbage and do 100 firewood. Let's do 300 cherries and 100 firewood. Kind of makes more sense to do it that way, I guess. Uh, oh, they need ale. Oh, so how much is all 20 of our beer? That's 160. Let's take 80 eggs. I mean, we could do this all day long. Uh, 300 berries. Oops. 300 berries and 100 firewood. Make that trade. Uh, there's some plums. Yeah, we're getting our food back now. Uh, let's do 300 plums and 100. That should be enough. That should be enough. We won't dismiss him. We'll just kind of pause it here. Uh, so after the disaster, we have rebuilt, we have full cemetery, we had a big cemetery up here, it's just 46, they're digging up people. There's our cemetery, we've halved our cows, so we'll have, uh, it'll take a while, but these cows will fill back in, we have six here now, we want 12, then they'll start killing them again and getting the hide. But anyway, this has been another episode of Putner. We're still waiting on those seeds, potatoes, and I forget. Um, what is the other one? Potatoes and cabbage. Yeah, potatoes and cabbage. So until then, uh, thanks for watching.